The Force is with you, now and always. Master Orgus? His power is growing. Only you can stop him. You must go to Tatooine. I've learned better than to argue with the voices of the dead. A starship crashed in a desert canyon. Use the Force. Find it. Who were you talking to? The holocom's not even on. This is crazy, but Master Orgus was standing right there. He spoke to me. He's not alive like that, T7. Master Quix once told me powerful Jedi can live on through the Force after they die. Not a social call, then. What did Master Orgus say to you? There's a crashed starship in a canyon on Tatooine. I can almost see it in my head. Then hold that thought. Next stop, Tatooine. I know your face. The one who defeated Darth Angrel, the hero of Tython. <laughs> My mission was a secret. No one knew where I was. How did you find me? The spirit of my dead master, Orgus Din, sent me here. He said you needed help. Thank the Force, and your master. I thought I was dead. Under the circumstances, I think we had better contact my superiors. I'd almost repaired my hollow before the Sith ambushed me. Jomar! Where are you? Masters, I completed my mission, but Sith assassins shot down my vessel over Tatooine. The spirit of Master Orgus Din sent my rescuer. I believe you know her. The Force wants our mission to succeed, Master Satya. This is proof. I knew she was the nexus of our fates, but events are transpiring faster than I foresaw. We never get a break, but you can always count on me. Jomar, the medical shuttle is en route. Before it arrives, give your rescuer the sensor logs you recorded. Bring us those logs immediately. We'll explain everything when you're on Tython. This burden is now yours. Guard it with your life. Go. Hurry. This area is dangerous. I'll stay until the medical shuttle arrives. What I've given you cannot wait. We'll meet again on Tython. May the Force be with you. I brought the sensor logs, Master Satil. I'm sure you have many questions. Master Tolbraga will answer them. It's good to finally meet you in person. They say you're the greatest Jedi the Order has seen in generations. I believe the Force has guided you to me. Together, we'll defeat the Empire. Restoring peace to the galaxy is the reason I became a Jedi. I'm organizing a top-secret strike team of our best and brightest, Jedi who don't know the meaning of failure. Twice, you've saved the Jedi Order from destruction. Mengelmore and Darth Angle were formidable opponents. Now I ask you to confront the ultimate evil and help me capture the Sith Emperor. You don't dream small, do you, Master? There's an ancient fortress orbiting the Imperial homeworld, Droman Kaas. It's hidden by a powerful cloaking device. The Emperor rules his people from this cloaked fortress. Not even the highest-ranking Sith can find him. But we're going to locate that fortress, get inside it, and seize the Emperor. If there's a way to achieve these goals, we must find it. We've already made great strides toward our objective. The man you saved on Tatooine scouted the Drummon Kaas system. His sensor logs will help us plan this assault. We'll plot a hyperspace route through the Imperial Navy's defenses. Slip right past them. Other members of my strike team are uncovering ways to pierce the cloaking device and defeat the security around the Emperor's fortress. I could use your expertise on Dalmora. The Empire and Republic are at war there and the fighting has endangered our mission. My ship's ready for departure. Tell your people I'm on my way. We've placed great responsibility on you, but I know you won't fail us. Contact your fellow strike team member, Warren Sedora, when you reach Balmara. He'll explain the mission. We're going to save the galaxy. May the Force be with us. Ah, Master Braga told me you were coming. Warren Sedoro, a pleasure. I'm grateful for your assistance. The situation is growing desperate. The Republic picked an unfortunate time to drive the Empire off Balmora. It's made our team's mission that much harder. Every world we take from the Empire brings us one step closer to victory. True, but I hope to achieve our goal with minimal violence. 
That's hard to do in a war zone. Balmora is home to the largest weapon manufacturing plants in the galaxy. Half the munitions used in the last war originated on this world. The Empire develops horrific new instruments of destruction here. Balmora's creations have killed countless innocents. All that terrible power in the hands of the Sith. We can't let them keep it. I appreciate the sentiment, but be mindful of our mission. We're here for one particular item. We've learned the Empire has a cloaking device prototype at one of Balmora's advanced weapon factories. It's the same technology hiding the Emperor's fortress. If we obtain that cloaking device prototype, we can understand how it works, develop a way to see through it. Expose his hidden fortress and the Emperor becomes vulnerable. Finding the cloaking device prototype is almost impossible thanks to the invasion. We need experienced native guides to sort through the chaos. Balmora has a well-established civilian resistance. Their spy network's knowledge of the Empire would be invaluable. Sounds like we'll need the Resistance if we're going to find the cloaking device. Unfortunately, the Resistance doesn't trust the Republic. Despite my best negotiations, they remain uncooperative. Can't say I blame them. The Empire's driven us off this planet twice already, leaving the Resistance holding the bag. Republic Command just intercepted a distress call. A Resistance medical facility is about to be overrun. I'd go, but an Imperial armor column's in my way. I need you to save that medical facility. I'll break that siege. Where am I going? I'm sending the medical facility's location. I don't know what you'll be facing there, but do whatever you must to save the Resistance fighters. I'll meet you there as soon as I can. May the Force be with you. You wanted to talk? I trust you, T7. Whatever it is, it can't be that bad. Don't worry about it, little fella. I thought you had some dark, terrible secret. Shafu may have been a slaver. But he changed his ways. At his heart, he was a decent person. Master Zalo saw that, and so did you. You wanted to see me? Just stick with it. You'll figure it out. What was your mission? <laughs> the Geno Harridan are the galaxy's deadliest assassins. How could the SIS expect you to stop one of their agents? The Ambassador may have resigned, but you saved his life. You're a hero, T7. What's it say? If we have Imperial Sympathizers inside the Republic, we need to know who they are. Time to pay House Bayless a visit. I'm sensing a pattern here, T7. 